to another vlog. So I am currently about to go pick up some pizza because y'all I had a time last night. Last night was single de Mayo. And let's just say the look of one. So I'll insert some clips. Um <laughs> I'll insert some clips from that that night. I Just not recovering so embarrassing but i just have some clues of me out and about for single de mayo i'm currently about to go to get some pizza from little caesars because for one people be sleep on little caesars y'all be sleep two i really wanted some cheese sticks so i just ordered a pizza too so i'm gonna go pick that up and i just realized i lost my little so I'm gonna go get some more of that on the way to my pieces to be get ready. And um I don't know if y'all can see it, but like right here on my eyes, it's still makeup residue there, and I don't know how to get rid of that. Um, because I have to like rub it and like pull it off, and I don't want to pull off my lashes. So I um I'm gonna try to get some micellar water. And try to get that off as well. And then my remote's not working. So I'm going to have to pick up some new batteries. So we're about to go to Walmart. Um, and do that. And when I come back, I'm going to uh, do my best to be productive. Because y'all, it's after 7 o'clock. Which means I have been recovering the whole day. And the day is gone. So... I'm going to try to be productive when I come back. I got laundry back here that I need to fold. I have my hair that I'm about to do. Um, and I need to pay some bills because it's the first of the month. So, yes. Also, I have a, um order from Sephora that just came in. So, I'll just show y'all what I got. And, yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, if you haven't already, go ahead and like, comment, share, and subscribe down below. Um, and yeah, let's get into it. And I done lost my lip oil. And they are freaking sold out. I'm so hurt. I'm mortified. I am so upset about this because I just lost my lip oil. And they ain't got none left. Wow. So now I'm going to have to go try to find it elsewhere maybe at Ulta or Target because it was hella oils here but oh well now I did not know it was this many um micellar waters but I'm leaning towards this one because it has like a glow and they have some small ones so I'm gonna try it out first I always thought this was cool because it's my name and it's spelled exactly how my name is spelled. So they got LA Colors has a lip oil, but this ain't gonna be the same effect. But I'm gonna try it anyways. It's only a dollar ninety eight, 
but I really, 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 really wanted my Milani. <laughs> All right, guys, so I'm back. I just wanted to show you guys what I was doing. So I'm about to do a quick weave wig. I already done um, sew down the closure and I'm about to go ahead and put the tracks on with some glue. This is the hair that I'm using. Can y'all see that? It's this brand. But this is the hair I'm using. It comes with the closure and three bundles. Um, I got this on sale for $70. This hair is usually $229. And I got the inches 12, 14, 16 because I want something that's going to be like a little natural and shorter because I've been wearing longer hair. So, yes, I'm excited about this. First time for everything, we're gonna see how we're gonna see how this go. So I'm just gonna uh, give y'all a heads up. If y'all see me looking this way, I'm looking at myself in the mirror as I'm doing my hair. All right? <laughs> This is like really, hmm, I'm liking the length already. This is only two bundles. I only used uh, 16 and 14, so I haven't even touched the 12. But it's very natural looking. And this uh, closure to be a drugstore closure. It's uh, transparent. It's on the lighter side. It's not thick, thick, but so far so good i'm liking it so we're going to continue to uh style it and then i'm gonna come back and show you guys the final look well show you guys the final look <laughs>
right, so I just put a few curls in it. And this is how we're looking. I might cut a few layers in the front tomorrow. But this is how it's looking. Like, it's just very natural looking. And I like that. So different. A little growner. <laughs> but I like it. And I'm going to throw some rolls in in the morning. But this is how we're looking. It's the final result. I'm probably going to fix this too. Honestly, I haven't really did much with this. Uh, but I'm probably going to fix it in the morning. But I don't know. I'm kind of liking just keeping it with the natural look with no baby hairs. But this is what we're looking at now. So I'm about to do my skin, my night time skin routine. And um, I'm going to show y'all that. And then I'm going to crash because it's been a long day. The girl has been recovering. And we got to get ready for tomorrow. So... I'm going to show y'all this routine really quickly. Show you what I'm using. And yeah, let's get into it. All right, so really quickly, I'm going to show y'all my nighttime routine. So this is a good molecule stand account. If you don't like good molecules, then you just don't like me because I mess with them hard. So once again, I've shown y'all before. If you'll focus, my hyaluronic acid serum. So I'm going to start with this on my face and honestly it's about time for me to go and get some more so we're gonna start with that also of course my face is clean i um cleanse with my if it'll focus my Garnier fresh fruities however you say it but this is the micellar cleansing water so i already cleansed my face with that and now I'm going on top. Of course, I wash my face too. Make sure y'all washing your face. Because, yeah. Anyway, I wash my face first. That's vital. You don't want no crusty, dusty faces. And you put stuff on top of it. It's just wrong and unusual. But, start with a clean base. And then I went in with this micellar water. Just to make sure everything was clean. And got everything off. That was my hyaluronic acid. Next, um, I'm going to go in with my discoloration correcting serum. Okay. So. Oh. Okay, yeah, I'm going to have to get some more. But I'll put this on the outer skirts of my face if anything comes out. Because, ooh. For dark marks. So I like to concentrate it on my high pigmentation around my face and like under my eyes because that's pretty much where mine is at. And just a side note, I just wanted to add in like, as black women, we all have a little bit of high pigmentation in some form because we're never one color. So this serum really does work with helping to uh, fade some of those dark marks if you use it on a consistent basis. Now, me on, personally, I don't use it consistently as I should, but I sh I'm definitely gonna have to start back. And I need to get another bottle of that too. So I might grab some more of this tomorrow when I go to Ulta. All right, so after that, I go on my Niacinamide Serum. And I focus this like around the most textured places on my face. So like my nose and around my nose and under my eyes mostly. But nevertheless, it's gonna go everywhere. And by the way, I don't know what I'm watching. I don't even know who I'm watching. My TV just going to whoever on YouTube. But yeah, here we go. So after that, this is the last, well no it's not, second to last um, thing. I'm gonna go in with the overnight exfoliating treatment. I only use this like maybe once or twice a week. Do not go over twice. But this is how it looks. And it has AHA and BHA on it. On it, in it. <laughs> and she feels on top of the way clearly but it's okay and i'm just gonna put this all over 
because I mean AHA and BHA helps to just like repair the skin in a way like it helps the skin like resurface like new skin so essentially when you're exfoliating you're getting really rid of dead skin cells right right so it just helps with that and it helps with the cells that are forming after that i hope that's making sense now when you first start using it it might tingle a little bit but as you start getting um, acquainted with it it doesn't bother you but this is how we're looking so far because i go hard for them and i put everybody i know on today products especially this one the hyaluron um, acid serum especially this one i put everybody on today stuff because it works tremendously so that's it for tonight i will see you guys in the morning when i um unpack my sephora order and get ready so bye hey girl hey so this is the next day i'm getting ready for my lunch but then i just remember as i was starting my makeup that's why i'm looking a little matte right here i used the um this is my first time using this product so i hope it works it's the elf uh, matte putty primer and i use this in my t-zone area around my nose and like my smile lines under my eyes like where i usually get oily or creasy and i put that on top of my elf powder Grip primer which is a milk dupe if y'all don't know already go get this ten dollars literally does the same thing as the milk so that's all i have on my face right now aside from like you know my skincare routine but then i thought about it and i was like didn't i just order something so i have my package from sephora and i'm about to open it up um this is just my birthday um gift and i ordered charlotte tilbury spray because i've heard really good things on it and i wanted to see what the hype was about so Find out. So I have the Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray from Charlotte Tilbury, and I heard good things about this, y'all. Good things about this product. So they, they claim that the one size spray is supposed to be a good dupe for it, and also the Revolution Super Fix is supposed to be a good dupe for it too. So I have this one already, but then I was like, I want to try everybody duping. So I'm gonna try the original. <laughs> so I got a, a little mini one, but it's not even a mini, it's just a smaller version. And I wanna try it out and see if it's worth the hype. This is how it looks out the package. So hopefully it do what it's supposed to do, especially since I, I got like a little my day is not going to be long, per se, but I do have this lunch, and then I plan on stopping my Target in Ulta, and then I'm coming back to film another video. So, hopefully, my makeup lasts throughout the day, and this is my free makeup gift. Sephora has the best free gifts. I didn't even bother getting mine from Ulta because it was just not worth it for the month of April. But this is the Glow Recipe. All it means, and I'm excited about this because I actually wanted to purchase um, the Glow Recipe. This one, the Dew Drops. So, this is the Watermelon Glow Niacinamide Dew Drops. A little mini version. Okay, I am really cute, and you know, I love pink. And this is the PHA plus BHA Pore Tight Toner from the um, same line. So I'm looking forward to using this. I'm definitely gonna use it tonight since I didn't use it today before I put my makeup on, but I'm definitely gonna use it tonight. But I'm definitely gonna be using this spray first. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish my makeup, uh, do my hair really quickly. I got like an hour left to get ready for real, to get out the door, to be on time. So, yeah, I will see you guys when I get done and get dressed. <laughs> good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome back to another vlog. I just woke up. 
as you can see, it is Wednesday. Um, I don't even know the date off the top of my head. Maybe the 17th, not really sure, but it'll be on the screen. But it is Wednesday. Today is my We Go V Wednesday, We Go V Shot Day. So I'm gonna show you guys how I take my We Go V shots. I don't even remember where I took it at last week, but it's now the here, here, but you know who. And I'm gonna take y'all with me as I get ready to go to work, so. All right, guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and take my We Go V shot. Um, so my doctor gave me a sample. I was taking this prior, so this would technically be my se second month taking it. It comes in a box like this. And you get four syringes that look like this. And pretty much it's real simple. You just keep on refrigerated. I have a beauty fridge, so I just keep mine in the refrigerated. Oh, I can talk beauty fridge. Yeah. But yeah, I'm gonna show y'all how I take it. I have a 0.25. And I'm gonna show y'all how I take my shot. So I prefer the stomach versus the thighs because it's a little bit easier. So I'm gonna show y'all. All right, so my stomach a little ashy. I did it on this side the last time, so I want to do it on this side this time. So this is alcohol. You want a cotton pad to clean off the area. how it looks as you can see Ooh. as you can see right now it's clear it's gonna turn yellow this is gonna turn yellow when it's done so you're just gonna take it and then you're gonna push until you hear a click and it's gonna click again when it's done then hold it for 10 seconds afterwards one Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then it looks like this when it's done. I don't know why I wasn't filming this ahead of time, but I'm just putting on this is an old unit. I don't had this hair since October. And I got it from, oh, Nadula? I don't know. Uh, actually, I'm lying. I didn't get from no Nadula. I got this hair from um, a company by the name of Dolls. This company. But I have it linked below in my Amazon storefront. So you can find it in the description box. So you guys can go look at it, but this is some really good hair. And I done had it, and I don't take it through trials and tribulations. This is literally old curls I'm finna revive from Cinco de Mayo. And um, it's a five by five closure unit. All right, so first thing first, I'm gonna go ahead and just cleanse my face with some micellar water. And um, I'm gonna take a cotton pad. I've been using these from this brand. Hold on. If y'all can see that. I think it's called Shizito. I don't know, but they are really, really nice. Really, really nice. And I think you can find them at also in, in um Sephora, maybe. I got mine from TJ Maxx, but same difference. So after we clean our skin with that Garnier, I'm going to go in with my toner. Um, I got this for my birthday from Sephora and I actually really been liking it. I've been wanting to try it but I got it for free. It's the glow ooh, the glow recipe toner and um dew drops. I do like this so I might just go ahead and just order the full size and it's no good ooh, and I'm wasting it. Yeah, 
So after I go in with the toner, so all right. After that, I'm gonna go in with my my good molecules hollering at this. Always go up. So more of them are going to be right. Now we'll leave the drops on the whiskey. And I'm going to use this. Also, I'll put me next. Perfect. I don't know how I forgot my lips, but this is a sleeping mask. It's by Lene. I hope it's focusing, but this is what I'm gonna use on my lips today because they need it. And then I'm gonna put my lip over on last. All right, so I'm gonna go in with my Laneige Radiancy Cream. And also, Right. That's it for the face. I'm gonna go in with my Milani lip oil in the shade. Well, not the shade, but the um flavor raspberry peach. And that's really it. This is not how I usually do this, but the first time, oh, this is like a quick and easy way. I'm just going to do this. I was just saying, but typically I'll lift this hair down, and then I'll put it in the tangle, and then I'll add the hair, and then I'll add this. Or the pink one, which is like a little bit I'll add. But even for the most part, you can see you can detangle this hair with your fingers. Because it really doesn't get that tangled. You just have to take care of your hair. So if you take care of your hair, it will take care of you. And like I said, I've had this unit since October. Now, I'm going to get dressed. I'm going to have to go up.